let's talk about the difference between help and help to. Of course, I'm Jennifer from jforestenglish.com and this channel is dedicated to helping you sound like a fluent, confident, natural English speaker. Now, before we go any further, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell icon so you're notified every time I post a new lesson. Now, let's dive in with this video. Let's take a look at the difference between help and help to. So let me give you an example sentence. I could say, can you help me finish the report? Or I can say, can you help me to finish the report? So notice in the first sentence, I use help and a base verb. Now the base verb is simply the infinitive, which is to plus base verb, that's the infinitive. So we take our infinitive and we get rid of to. So here we have help me finish, help and the base verb. Now we can compare that to our second example. Can you help me to finish the report? So in this case, we have help and the infinitive, which is to plus base verb. So the only difference between sentence one and sentence two is that sentence one uses the base verb and sentence two uses the infinitive. So which one's correct? What do you guys think? Which one's correct? Sentence one or sentence two? So put it in the comments now. Put a one if you think one is correct and two if you think two is correct. Put it in the comments now. So if you said sentence one, you're correct. And if you said sentence two, you're correct. <laughs> They're both correct. This is an exception in English because you have to keep in mind that the normal sentence structure in English is verb plus infinitive. Help is our first verb. Finish is our second verb normal sentence structure would be verb plus infinitive. Let me give you an example with the verb need. In this case, we would have need and then the verb that comes next would be in the infinitive. I need to finish the report. This sentence is correct. Now, what if I said I need finish the report and I just use the base verb? What do you think? This sentence is incorrect because the regular, the normal English sentence structure is verb plus infinitive. Help is an exception, okay? So you need to think of help as an exception. What I'm telling you right now only applies to the verb help. With the verb help, we have two acceptable structures. We can use help plus base verb or help plus infinitive. There's no difference at all between them. Now, although both are grammatically correct, in American English, one of these structures is way more common. Way, 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 way more common. Do you know which one is more common? Do you think structure one is more common or structure two is more common? Well, in American English, American English specifically, in American English, structure one, help plus base verb is way, 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 way more common. I would say 99% of American English speakers would say, can you help me finish the report? So to sound more natural, I do recommend using help plus base verb, especially if you're an American English speaker, but just know that both are grammatically correct. All right, so now it's your turn to practice. I want you to leave three examples using help and the base verb, okay? So I want you to leave a positive sentence, a negative sentence, and a question. So are three different forms. Now I only want you to use help and base verb because I imagine right now you already use the infinitive structure. I find most students do. Because of that, you're already comfortable with it and I want you to get comfortable with using help 
and the base verb. Now just remember, verb plus base verb is specific to the verb help. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button, share it with your friends, and of course, subscribe. Now before you go, make sure you head on over to my website, jforestenglish.com, and download your free speaking guide. In this guide, I share six tips on how to speak English fluently and confidently. And until next time, happy studying. So you probably use help and infinitive, am I right? Maybe it sounds weird for you to use help and base verb, which is funny because it sounds weird for me to use help and infinitive, and it probably sounds weird for you to use help and base verb. But don't worry, if you wanna sound really natural, just practice it, you'll get it. So leave your examples in the comments, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.